morning. Good morning. morning. There's a lot going on because we have two storms that we're keeping an eye on. The first one uh, is going to bring some snow through the northern plains in the upper Midwest. So we have winter storm uh, watches, advisories, warnings in effect. You can see as we go through the day today, just north of Chicago, more up into Wisconsin, into uh, Minnesota, Iowa, that's where we'll see most of our accumulating snow with some isolated stronger storms on the southern side of this whole system. And then it moves through Michigan and then New York, Pennsylvania as we go into Friday. This will turn into a coastal storm. New York City is kind of right on that line. I think we'll maybe end up with about an inch in New York City itself, but you go north and west and some of the higher elevations, you go up into New England, that's where we'll see more along the lines of accumulating snow. And then this whole storm system will exit as we go into Saturday morning. So I'd say a widespread four inches or so, but you will have some higher amounts. Out near Milwaukee, it could be closer to six. Detroit could be closer to about four to six inches. And then scattered higher elevations across upstate New York and into Pennsylvania, where we could see about four to six inches. We also have that big storm system approaching the west coast this time around. Not so much snow, but rain will become a big issue, and we'll have much more on that coming up in our next half hour, Savannah. All right, Dylan, thank you. In the meantime, we are learning more about that deadly.